Yeah, I just got back from a night out. Here's Peanut. Look at these guys. You want to talk about food motivated? This is food motivated. There comes Abe. What's up, Abe? Come here, buddy. Come here. No, no. Hey. Here's Abe. Here's Abe, my ram. What's up, buddy? What's up? Boy, you guys are aggressive. Flo. Flo, come on. You got to cut. You got to break sometime, girl. I got this guy. He's got no problems. He's a bud. Let's 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 go around here. I got I got I just brought a round bale out because these guys chowed my pasture already. They're pigs. They're supposed to be sheep, but they're pigs. Actually, they just eat a lot. Come here, Abe. Hey, buddy, come here. Come here. You want to see how fun this is? Look at this. Come here, buddy. Come here. Ah, here's Peanut. Peanut's always a Peanut's always a player, but Abe is too. And now Tanner's gonna push through the door. He's probably right behind me. Yeah, there he is. But Abe likes, Abe likes getting his head scratched, don't you, buddy? Yeah. Tanner, you gotta, Tanner, you gotta let him go. You're okay, buddy. Yeah, Peanut's gonna take care of Tanner. <laughs> this, this is, this is why I enjoy this farm. Hey, you know what? Sometimes humans aren't your best friends. Sometimes it's little guys like this. Little guys like Peanut. Cause look at this. She just loves this food, don't you, buddy? Yeah, she does. This 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 sheep, she wasn't very friendly. Now, she's a good she's a good girl. She's the oldest one. But this guy that's peeking around the corner, he's he's the stud. That's Abe the Ram. This is Tanner <laughs> Tanner the harasser. That's what I'm gonna call you. So he's figured out, if you notice, this is a sliding door. That's a sliding door. He's figured out that because there's no rail on the bottom and because he's a strong dog and he's a smart dog, he can do this and get enough space. This is how I lost my sheep today. I was bringing this bale in and he figured out he can pull the sliding door away and walk behind it. It's all good when it's this door, because out there is the pasture. It's fenced in. Where it becomes a problem is that end of the hog barn. I call it the hog barn because that's what this used to be. It's going to be the chicken barn. But this door here, no problem. Round bale got out there. I had it staged. The bale was like covering just the width of the door. It was planned perfectly. Back here behind me, I had that sliding door closed all the way. Right? Good plan. If the sheep get through this door, I got this door stopping them. That's only a good plan when you don't have a freaking German Shepherd Husky that's got a brain bigger than most of the people I've met in my life. So he was an instigator on the sheep breakout. They got through the, the east sliding door, which was open. I opened it. That's how I got the round bale in, which, by the way, they've absolutely devoured. I got a back up there. But they wandered into this area. And as they wandered around, Tanner decided, hey, I'm going to hook you. I'm going to hook you up. And he essentially got down to this end. And this sliding door was closed as well. Like so. Well, guess what? When you're a big, strong, husky, German shepherd, you just do this. And you run out. That's what he did. That's how he got out. Oh, now he's gonna probably get the sheep out again. I better pay attention. Hey, it's late. These guys aren't supposed to have this much energy, but they do. And I bet Abe's going to head out here. All right. I just wanted to share a little tidbit, a little nugget of what I get when I come home from a great day of meetings, getting to know some people, and whatnot. I get greeted by Abe, Florence, and Peanut, and Tanner running around the pasture. So 
I'll be another hour and a half probably by the time I catch him and get him out of this pasture. So I hope you guys have a good night's sleep. I will too at some point. Brian from Soil to Soil. Peace.